Good evening, Mr. Bond. It is I, the host of the Casual Report, JT. Joined again by my beautiful, beautiful co-hosts. Got Bish in the house tonight. How are you, Bish? I'm all right, thanks, man. You living the dream, mate? I am doing good. Are you? I am living that dream. Buzzing? Always living that dream, mate. Of course you are, mate. Of course you are. I am buzzing. We got some big stories today. Huge stories, mate. What have you been up to, Bish, mate? Huge stories. Uh, honestly, music theory. I'm boring. Move on. <laughs> 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 show, show's <laughs> over, mate. Uh, all right. That's you, it. You heard that. That's it. End of story. Music theory, ladies and gentlemen. And Dan's uh, getting horrible echo. Why? Why is he getting an echo? Oh no, I'm listening. I'm oh, not I'm getting it on the stream. Beg your pardon. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not getting anything on my stream on my end. I don't know. Is it just Dan or? It could be. Um. It might be because I'm I've got the stream volume up and I, I can't. Yeah, I haven't got it's echo. Fine. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, Dan. Um, I apologise about that, dude. Um, just also, you make sure make sure you got your music on in the background. Do you you still do that? Yeah. Thank you, Bish. I forgot to play it. Two seconds. No worries, mate. Yeah, it's all right. I appreciate that. The other voice you hear is a uh, the worst rocket play league player I've ever seen. Just jams in the house. Jam, how are we today? There another jam here. No, you're here. What have you been up to, mate? I've been finishing some games. Been finishing some games. What have you been finishing, mate? I've been finishing a game. Do you want to... Oh. A game. I finished it. I've... I finished it. Three years later, right? Well, three, three years. This is probably a normal amount of time for someone to finish a game no. like this. You did it in ten minutes. It's no. been out, what? Eight weeks. April the 11th, I think. So, yeah, some of that. Eight nine. Weeks. Eight nine. Well, nine weeks. It's been eight nine weeks already. No jam. Next question. What did you think? Really good game. Mm -hmm. It's the first Final Fantasy game I've enjoyed since ten. Two thousand one, two thousand two ish, which is eighteen years. Yeah, I mean to be fair, we played ten so many times, so it's more fresh in my mind. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, really good game. Some padded out chapters. I've told Point you about. Lightly, some padded out chapters. Uh, yes, put it lightly. A whole mm. chapter of can you go find me this flower? Can you go get me this horn from this behemoth? Can you go? I don't know. I need some medicine. Just you've got legs. Do it yourself. Zip Why is Cloud got to do it? Up the fucking thing. Like, I'm, that's I'm already yeah. out. That's it's just a lot of seconds. padding out. Bishop hasn't played man. That's some We're gonna bore and him then, for the next ten minutes. We do apologise. And then. Um, but yeah, um, after a, well, 14 was the worst one. Uh, the first, whoa, first wait, chapter whoa, came whoa, out. Whoa, whoa, stop. Stop. Oh. Now, 13. Oh, chapter 14. I thought you meant Final Fantasy Chapter 14. 14. Right, no, no, no. Your pardon. Chap the first padded out chapter, I was mm -hmm. like, okay, that's cool, because it's quite early on. I'm learning how to do different things. I yeah. thought, that's fine. That's just like, a, you know, it's holding your hand a bit, playing mm -hmm. the game, that's fine with that. But when chapter 14 came along and it was a lot more long window long winded and like the search area was so much bigger i was like no so oh, remind me chapter 14 Cut. was the one with sorry but two seconds was the one right. with all the side quests in it right yes right which i still haven't done by the way of course you haven't skipped it I, I did some of them beat the big monster thing and then skipped it. Mm -hmm. But then straight after that, when you go into chapter 15 onwards, yes, yeah, it's, it's awesome. Right. It's sure. like mini boss after mini boss after big boss after mini boss is sick. Oh, yeah. Right. And uh, Bishop, you're going to say something. Sorry, dude. Oh, I, I don't think I you're not. No, no worries. No. Stay in the corner. Be quiet. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> um, yes, sir. Right. Right, warning to people in the chat, people are watching on YouTube. For the next five or ten minutes, I'm going to lift a lid on Final Fantasy VII Remake. Now, you may be thinking, how oh, can you spoil the 20-year-old game? Well, <laughs> well, if you have to ask that question, just mute me for a minute. Or skip. If you're watching on YouTube, skip this bit. I'll put the timestamps in the description for you, because I'm a nice guy. Um, if you're watching on in the chat, to bear with me i'm so sorry um I, I, just mute me and i'll throw the thumbs up and wave no i'll tell you what i'll do 
I will talk. I will send them a message in the chat for those yeah, okay. people that are in the chat. That'd yeah, be cool. Yeah. Cheers, YouTube. Bishop, mate. I appreciate that. Jam. Yeah. Were you not um, interested in that ending at all? Was that not? I was. No. I know it's a. No, well, I was tell you what. Sorry. To first question. Is Final Fantasy VII remake false advertising? I, I I'm about to blow you out the water, mate. Let's fucking go. Have you been watching loads of videos of this, have you? I was flabbergasted. I was, no, when it first finished, I was like, oh, cool, whatever. Then I thought about it. I was like, okay. I watched some theories and I watched um, Maximilian and Easy Allies talk about it. And I'm like, I'm fucking in, mate. That's it. Let's fucking go. Yeah. Sorry for the bang there. The microphone didn't like that. Um, but, right. Throughout the game, there are these, um, what are, are eventually called whispers. Um, yeah. Did you notice them? I'm sure you noticed it, them, Jim. Ah, uh, yeah. There was loads of them. Yeah. Um, do you have any idea what they represent? They have to keep things on the path to destiny or something like that. Mm -hmm. They prevent destiny changing. What does that remind you of? This is the most meta thing I've ever heard in my life, by the way. Let's go. What does that remind you of? Angry fans trying to keep Destiny on course while Square are trying to do their own thing with the remake. Right? Okay. You feel me now? Just stay with okay. me a minute. Just stay with me. They do, they do do that. Stay with me. I, I, that might okay. have been I, that might have not been done on purpose, but stay with me. Um. So there, there. If you noticed, you play the game the second time. I know it's a lot to ask for someone with a full time job and. Alive, but when you play the game a second time, you start to notice things. Jam, like Aerith hey. talks so much, like she says so much, and it's like, mm, do you know something here? Are you serious? And you get towards the Shinra building. And by the way, yeah. if you're if you're a new player to Final Fantasy VII and you get to the Shinra building and this fucking bloke called Sephiroth turns up with a massive sword, you're gonna think, who the fuck is this guy? Yeah, some Sephiroth. of the things they say, and I'm like, you know something, mate. This, and I'm going to direct you now. There's a bit at the end. It's the end of. Cri Did you watch that video I sent you, the Crisis Core thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You notice it's exactly the same carbon copy of what happened to Zack at the In, remake. Yeah, yeah. So when he, and did you notice I, I sent you the picture of Stamp as well? Yeah. As a diff, you know where I'm going with this. How have you not got there yet? Yeah, no, I got so this is that. I know Stamp was the guiding yeah. that's what yeah. the, this, Avalon is, this is that planted yeah. the guy uh, yeah and then oh branching timeline and Stamp is now a terrier and not a I'm not very good with dogs I can't remember what it is originally is it Dashund? Uh oh I just thought yeah yeah, yeah. okay you so would be so different, far different, yeah 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 because in the original one sorry I'm I'm, I'm I've not thought this through properly, but Wedge and Biggs and everyone die at the at the fall of the pillar. Yeah, yeah. They so do. for him to be alive at the end, they've changed the timeline. Is not <laughs> for him to be alive at the end of Seven Remake. Mm hmm. He shouldn't be alive, Jam. Aerith's gonna survive. This is what I'm people. saying. I don't know. Listen to me. Is this just, I mean, Destiny has, some things have to happen in time. I think people, people like, because the last bit of Final Fantasy VII Remake is, what's it called? Where everything's just in like one, like all timelines meet and it's, do you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, do you? Did you even play the game, Jam? Jam, Jam generally, this yeah. is Jam, this is generally Jam's brain right now. <laughs> I watched this like less than twenty-four hours ago. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Uh, what's it called, Mars? I don't know. Is that right? What's it? So sorry, but anyway, I can't remember. It's like the where all timelines meet. Yeah. Yeah. Have you seen Advent Children? Yes. You don't remember it though, do you? No, because I don't <laughs> need you to scan, watch it once. Did you scan them arbiters, the, the three of them that you fight? No. 
so yeah, assess them. Yes, sorry, assess them. Yeah. No, I didn't assess so them. So if you assess them, I kind mm -hmm. of gathered by the color how what their weaknesses were. Mm -hmm. oh, it goes deep, mate. I'm about to take you to fucking school, mate. <laughs> right. So you, you assess them, and one, put one uses fists. Yeah. Stay with me. Yeah. One uses the blade. One's got a gun. Yeah. You with me so far? And you assess them, and it yeah. says that they are f the future renditions of themselves, in the future. Yeah. So were they Who fight? Were they they fighting themselves from the future? Or are they? Because because when, cause when I assessed them, I was like, "That's Cloud <laughs> Tifa and Barrett from the future trying to trying to keep Destiny on course for what happens in the first the original game, right?" So yeah. But then you go. And then you watch Advent Children, and it's like Kadaj, the fucking three Advent Children, what the fuck they're called? Kadaj, Thingy, and the other one. No oh, idea. Yeah. Do you understand? They. I, they, I understand, but I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it could be them from the future. Now, Kadaj, Lars, and Yazoo, right? So it could be them from the future. Bishop's gone. Bishop's had enough, mate. He's literally just fainted. He's, he can hear us still. So. He's throwing up. <laughs> <laughs> like, um, could be them, right? Does Seth, is it the same Sephiroth from the first game here? Oh, that because he's got his wing. Be different. And yeah, I've not played Final Fantasy VII for about fifteen years, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't have his wing until later on in the game. It should be in the crater, and the fucking Genova's Genova's witnesses are there. He just yeah. jumped between them and really Sorry, hit my mic. That was a terrible joke. Yeah, that's the, <laughs> and it's like, hang on a minute. That's actually and, really clever. Yeah, no, it's fucking genius. When you think about this game, it's fucking genius. And when Hojo says to Cloud, well, starts to say to Cloud, oh, he goes, oh, I'm soldier first class. Like, Hojo's like, hold on. Hold on, bruh. And then the arbiters are, well, the, the whispers carry him away. Yeah. Now, Zach's alive somewhere now, right? Because mm -hmm. he's carrying Cloud. And Aerith knows something, mate. Because Aerith, fucking, they, they cross on the bridge. Different timelines, they cross on the bridge, yeah, and she's yeah, like, hang yeah. on a minute. What's going on here? Mm hmm And, uh, I mean, this opens the door for so much. The, the main problem with this ending, right, is they hit so many notes in the original game, where's the sequel's going to go? Because you've got the battle of the edge of creation, Yeah. Bishop's fuming. I want to be in a few minutes, Bishop, I promise. You've got the Age of Creation, Sephiroth and Cloud fighting each other, blocks Omni Slash. He's like, now, nah, mate. I see why you went off and played all the other games. Yeah, and watch he, he's Andrew. like, now, nah, mate, go away. And the song at the Age of Creation is or, what? Without the one from Advent Children. No. There is a song in Advent Children in the game, but it's not that one. Yeah, I know. That one's from the first one. That's that. City of the Ancients theme. What happens in the city of the ancients, Jam? They all die. Well, Aerith dies. And if it is yeah. an alternate timeline, and you were, you say, oh, we just might be playing a different Final Fantasy yeah, the, Seven. This is the this Final is Fantasy the theory. Daniel agrees, I think, with me. I'm not sure. No, I think he's agreeing with no, Bishop. He's just agreeing <laughs> with me. It's fine. You're all right. <laughs> right, yeah, I see where you're at. I see yeah, that would be cool. I'd be down with that if they, if it wasn't. No. Yeah, it's a remake, but we're playing an alternate timeline, so it actually is another Final Fantasy mm. VII game that and ties in with the other one. That's cool. And the definition of remake is to make something again. That's, yeah, that's one of, that's either the noun or the verb. I can't remember which one. It I is, suppose if they called it remaster, ah. then it'd be a carbon copy. Is my next I question, remake. which is answered now. Why didn't they call it remake part one? Because all of what you said might have just actually been a total yeah. bullshit. And you say Jessie's not alive. Well, well. She could be. What if she's alive in this whole I mean, time? We better be getting a part two. Oh, we will. So, well, it'll be part two, but it, the this th theory I saw... Harry Potter. This isn't Harry Potter. I'm playing <laughs> Final Fantasy. We love Harry Potter here. <laughs> on the <laughs> it's really funny. It's really funny because I, I could do the exact same thing as what you guys are doing right now. Kingdom Hearts. But with Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. And who directs it, 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 Bishop. It's, yeah. I ask a question to you, mate. Who directs oh, Kingdom Hearts? I don't know. Tetsuya Nomura. Who directed Final Fantasy okay. VII Remake? 
Right, okay. Let's see mm. what we're going here. Oh, and by the way, the big Arbiter Whisper thing, the massive one in the middle, yeah. looked exactly like Bishop. You can help me out with this one, mate. You can, yeah. Useful I, for this I, conversation, I, mate. I that. Um, what are the things called in Kingdom Hearts, mate, where the big shadow things... Um, I'm not playing... I've only played the first one. The big shadow things? You know, the big... The, the Heartless, is it? Or the... Heartless, yeah. Because the, the last boss in Final Fantasy... Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put a picture up. That's um, a good idea, though. The last boss in Final Fantasy... I'm not saying they're going to cross. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that it's just as bad shit. And then, um... Yeah, one of the fairies no, I, I saw... Um, if they cross, they grew in it. Yeah. One of the fairies I saw in, um... Like a, in, in like a YouTube comment section was, um... Final Fantasy Re 7 Remake. Final Fantasy 7... Reunion, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, something like that, which that's that. nothing's out of the realm of possibility here. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Oh, and by the way, when Kadaj, Loz, and Yazoo die in, in Advent Children, they merge into Bahamut. Now, I asked you the question, Jam. Ah, uh, 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 yeah. Uh, Mate. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, uh. Whisper Harbinger. Oh, sorry, Bishop. Something has clicked. Yeah, you, you, you're starting to click now, mate, aren't you? You're starting to get there. Yeah. Um, Bishop, if you could just watch the stream in two seconds, bud. Uh, Conspiracy gets deeper. This creature here looks like a shadow heartless thing in Kingdom Hearts. I can't remember the real name. Do you see the resemblance? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just a heartless. They're just called heartless. Heartless, yeah. They're... It's like a heartless boss, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Bishop. I know, which, I know you're on you've, uh, you've been a great... And, uh, like, this opens the door so many possibilities for me, because, like, for example, it's Jesse, like I was saying, Jesse's still alive in another timeline. If the timelines are mixed now, because fate and destiny are dead, like, you could go to Golden Saucer, she could have been the star role in the Golden Saucer, like she wanted to do if you... you yeah. You know, yeah. And they're like, everyone's like, oh, Jesse, 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 and Jesse's like... Who are you guys? Oh, fuck off, mm. mate. Let's fucking go. Get me Zach Fair in that party as well. <laughs> mate, That'd I'm sick. fucking... Yeah, imagine getting yeah. Zach. I, I recommend. I I'll send you this. I I'll send you the... We'll link. actually get a character with some personality. Cheeky, mate. I'll send you the link, and I'll put it in the YouTube comments and stuff. Um, <laughs> yes. this, this is like a, it's like two hour long, but... Um, you you like Maximilian, don't, don't lie, you? this is making me want to do it on hard mode. Oh, mate, trust me. You play it on hard mode. Aerith says things. I'm like, you fucking know, don't you? If this is the thing, though. If I do it on hard mode, I want to go for the plan. Yeah. And Sephiroth, I'm like, you fucking know. You're trying to fucking swindle this so you win. Because he know, in think about it, he knows he loses if it's not the Sephiroth we know. If it's not the... the yeah, so yeah. So he yeah. knows he loses, so he goes back and tries to get Cloud to do his dirty for him. And mm -hmm. Mate, I am... I'm in. So technically, this could be Final Fantasy VII too. Yeah, this is that, that. That's the theory as well. I love yeah. stuff like this. this fucking, I love this. Really cool. I was going. It's like, actually really cool to think about. Generally, yeah. I actually really cool. Mass Effect. I, I was the same with Mass Effect. Mm -hmm. and this is the reason why I got into Dark Souls so much. Oh yeah. Because like just the just the consistent conspiracy, like 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 there's the theories of how of how the stories go and you know and how it yeah, all works yeah, together. Definitely. Halo, Halo is the same for me as well. Halo has got this massive, huge, oh, yeah. story. Oh yeah, those of and yet everything's kind of looped around and stuff like that, and very confusing. But if you add it all together, you kind of you have this bigger picture, this mm -hmm. massive universe, and that to me is a cool game. Mm -hmm. You know, that that is a game, a game franchise that really, really understands itself, and I love that. I absolutely mm. love it when games do That's that. That's really cool. And Final Fantasy is no exception. Mate, yeah. mate, I this is the biggest U-turn I've ever had on a video game. Like, when it first got announced, I was like, oh, cool. That was really cool. You nearly so, didn't buy it. Yeah, I nearly didn't buy it. I saw that gameplay in oh, 2016. I want to say 2016 at Paris Games Week. I was like, nah. I was like, this ain't this ain't, this ain't it, Chief. And then the mix-up came and Square Enix took it back in-house and there was all the big hubbub. And then mm -hmm. I saw that trailer. We, we watched that trailer, didn't we, Jam? At the State of Play, the one, the Sephiroth. I was like, yeah. okay, I was like, okay. I played the demo. I was like, do you know what? We'll see. I was completely out. And now I'm, for, now. I'm yeah, fucking exactly. out the other side, mate. I'm in. I'm on. <laughs> Buy me a season. Like, I'll pay them now. I'll pay whatever they want now. All, all the games. Do you know what I mean? Then, all the Final Fantasy 7s will get. Dan, I'm, I, I'm sorry, dude. I'll be two minutes. I'm so sorry. But... But <laughs> 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 I was... Oh, so good. Um, 
and it's like Bugenhagen, like Red's dad. I'm like, you know, you fucking know, mate. You, you Mr. Planet, and look at me, I'm a dickhead. I thought, right, you know, I'm fu- right. I'll, I'll show up now. It's brilliant. If you haven't played Final Fantasy, I'm I've, I've got to play it. Again. If you play it, no, trust me, jump. Play it hard mode. All the quit, like even the whispers, they're like, you're doing this on purpose. I fuck. Like, it's all orchestrated so it. Do you know what I mean? Like, for yeah, example, I'm, when yeah. Jesse hurts her ankle, they do that on yeah. purpose because then in the original game, Stop it. yeah, so Cloud goes instead of Jesse to the thing because Cloud mm-hmm. has to go to fall down the thing to meet Aerith. Mm-hmm. I want to blow up in a minute. Right. <laughs> Should we get on with the Move show? Moving on. Shall we, gentlemen? Right. Time for the news. A few stories today, gentlemen. After my meltdown there. Uh, what have we got? <laughs> Just a quick update um, for you boys. Do you remember on Tuesday mm. we talked about the Sea of the... Whatever it was. Yeah. Sea well, of uh, the Cursed Rat. Thank you, Bishop. Is it? I'm pretty sure. That is what it was. Sea of the Cursed Rat. Um, hit mm. Kickstarter. Nine hours later. Got funded. So... Nine hours? Nine episode. hours. Um, I might actually contribute to this myself because it looks so cool but um yeah just, it just does, it looks great i'm i'm really glad that they're actually getting this out there this mm-hmm. is great it's cool uh, i love it when like small people great ideas come to life i'm sure we all you agree. come with a better game mm-hmm. i love kickstarter kickstarter is great like some of the stuff like shoving out was on kickstarter now it's one of the biggest fucking side scrolls on the planet so yeah exactly dreams come true ladies and gentlemen that was just a quick one um another story gentlemen uh Konami have uh, published a game. They have what? Wait, what? What? <laughs> They're not published. So, but for spars and no, 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 gentlemen. Their name on it. Gentlemen, they've attached themselves to a, a video game, which looks it looks alright to me. This looks good. It this looks really looks cool. Yeah, um, I really like this. It reminds me of um, Funny Bones. I remember the, the same old thing. Yeah. yeah. The old dark, dark, child, child, dark, like dark thing. Yeah, this looks great. Mm-hmm. I mean, I really like the look of this. Yeah, um, artwork's great. Um, it's, it's got a bit of yeah. detail to it as well. Mm. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I can see that. Um, yeah, like the first thing I thought, Bishop, is exactly the same. The, the funny bones, the book thing. Mm-hmm. When I was, yeah, I was like, oh, that's cool. Um, glad Konami. Had, uh, I mean, I, I have a lot of bad blood with Konami. I don't. I, I'm, I'm not. A lot of people I, do. I'm not happy with them. There's that, that can always fuck. be a redemption story, though. Yeah, you I, like redemption I hope stories, we can, you said it yourself. Yeah, I, I hope we can sort something out with Konami that they're not just... I mean, I just... If they can, like, outsource the, like, franchises they have, like, Bloodstained... Did you any of you two play that? I don't think you did. Did you? I didn't, but no. it looked good. Yeah, I mean, it was, it was the next Castlevania game. I remember, I remember you telling me about it, mm-hmm. yeah. It was the next Castlevania game, it was great. And Metal Gear Survive can go and jump in the skip, but um, do you know what I mean? I mean, yeah. there, there, there are heavy I rumors. I forgot about that game. Exactly, exactly. And there are heavy rumors that um, Sony are sorting out a Silent Hill for us for the PS5, but we'll see that hopefully at the PS5. I'll look forward to Silent Hill. Yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit of a different horror. Silent Hill it's 2 more of is game. one of the greatest horror games ever made, and you can all. I've, I've, I've never played them, but I've sat and watched You've every not single one Silent of them. You've Silent Hill 2. Yeah, get off but no, I haven't. I watched get Alio off watch play one, two, and three, back to back. Oh, cool! I'll let you off them now. So I know what happens, and I've helped you out in the shoot scary parts with. She didn't like that. Yeah, it was great. That was like what, fifteen years ago. Bishop. Mm-hmm. Um, do you want to lead this next story? Because you are. Buzzing, my friend. I, I, I am actually genuinely you, buzzing. You know about what I'm story. talking about, mate. You know where I'm going with this, do you, do you, Are you going to put some, I'm gonna, some gameplay of this? I'm going to. What's the gameplay? I think there's only a thing. I've checked if there is gameplay. I didn't. I don't think I yeah, found so any. But, um, gameplay up. Um, so, this is the story that um, Kingdom of Alamo Reckoning, uh, which is an old game that came out in 2012. Uh, February, February of 2012. Um, it was an action role-playing game with RPG elements and also hack and slash. It was a very mixed bag in terms mm-hmm. of genre. It was very cool. Um, it's getting a remake or kind of 
a redo uh, kind of thing. And I, I couldn't be more buzzing for this. I, I kind of never played through the whole thing because it was massive. It's this huge, gigantic open world. And it's it was just so good. It was such such a good game. The hack and slash elements are really good. The the RPG elements are fantastic. It's got a bit of like a, a Morrowind slash uh, Skyrim feel to it. You've got this massive open world with like um, armors and weapons and all that kind of stuff that you can go around and, and, and you know you can collect throughout the world um, in chests and all Why sorts. That's, Sorry, um, that's okay. Uh, it was released. Get this, guys. It was released on Microsoft Windows. Do you no. guys remember that shit? <laughs> Vaguely. We're using it now. Vaguely. Microsoft Windows was terrible. The original Microsoft Windows was terrible. What, what was it about? Um, um, the, 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 the Windows Game Store. The original the, old uh, the, one. The yeah, original Windows Oh, okay, Store. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, was, was absolutely Sorry to interject as well, Bishop. They've changed it. Yeah, cool. Um, the art director I was on about was Todd McFarlane, the Spawn guy. Carry on. Right, right, right. Um... Games, that's the one. Games for Windows Live. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel. <laughs> um, so, it, this game was originally released on Games for Windows Live, PlayStation 3, and Xbox 360. Uh, it was developed by Big Huge Games and a development Great team name. called 38 Studios, mm -hmm. who, were, who, who, was also, who also published a game with EA. Um, free, 38 Studios, actually, weirdly enough, actually, they... they they filed for bankruptcy yeah, after it's this quite game. A, <laughs> which, it's was, quite, which is it's quite a rough patch. Put it, it into because... a great light, but <laughs> you're buzzing. But um, I, I, I love this game, and I'm super, super excited for a remake. Mm -hmm. The gameplay looks is like... this the footage of the no, remake? No, the, the, this is the old one. I, I, I can't find any footage of the. Of the I don't think it's there's not really... that bad. To be there is. Fair. I don't. I don't but, think there's any. No, I think it was just like yet. because the store listing went lot went live a bit early, and they were just leaned into it. Like, yeah. oh, fuck it. It's, f it's just a, just a little leak. It was just mm -hmm. a little leak on the internet. And okay. then, um, but uh, but yeah, no, I'm I'm super excited for this. Some of the weapon, some of the weapon designs are really cool as well. Yeah. Um, it's quite. Yeah. It it just it, it just really entertained me. It was a great game mm -hmm. and. I can't wait for this. I can't wait to see it. This can be fantastic. Jam. Did you, did you play this game? I've never heard of this game. Are you serious, mate? Yeah, never. Are Not you a lot mental? of people have. Not a lot of people have. Wow. I because I saw this and I was like, oh, the spawn guy is doing the. Oh, oh cool. All right, yeah. And then I never bought oh, yeah. it. I'm I part of the problem. I'm part of the problem. That company. I never bought it. Oh, it's one of them. I always wanted to play it. And now the, the, bankrupt, yeah, and now I'm gonna have to buy this one, aren't I? Fucking seething, but <laughs> probably gonna. Um, Jam, are you interested in this, or you're not too fussed? Um, that's not something I would probably follow and buy, but it's. I suppose, like you say, if Bishop was bought it, you bought it, it'd pique my interest, mm -hmm. especially if there's more. I'm pretty sure it's a single thing. player game anyway. Yeah. Okay, um, but I mean, even so, it, it's. It reminds me of go on. medieval. Well, yeah, it does, yeah. yeah I, I can, can kind of see uh, where from. Like a 3D Ghosts and Goblins. <laughs> Did you ever play the 3D one, Maximum? No. No. It's good. That's I know that game. Just, but, uh, it's good. Yeah, that's oh, yeah. The, that long the point of that as well. Just as a uh, as a question to the, to the to the chat currently, is there anybody in the chat that's actually played this game? Or is it all like me? Because... Fobbed it off. I'm interested, oh, they are to, I'm no interested to know. Um, but yeah. That's uh, that's Kingdoms, Kingdom of Alamo. Which the Kingdom is or Kingdoms? Yeah, I think it's Kingdoms. Kingdom yeah, of you're right. I, I was, it's uncanny. I was like, what is it? I don't know. Anyway, um, it's just so easy. It just rolls off the tongue. Kingdoms mm -hmm. just rolls off oh, the tongue. Oh, sick, mate. Um, yeah. So catch that out. And mm -hmm. uh, uh, Bishop, you're gonna have to help me out with this next one as well, mate. Because um, actually, before that, I would like to thank Daniel for following the show when it wasn't live. Because that, that's what heroes do. That is what heroes do. Um, you play Destiny Hero, 2, right? Hero, guitar, God, guitar man. Say again, sorry. You play Destiny 2, right? Destiny 2, mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. Um, did you see the thing? The the um, the new chapter will be revealed on the 9th of June, which is, I believe, Tuesday. Yeah. I have seen this, yes. Have this you played it since... Basically, an, an announcement of an announcement, yeah. essentially. Um, do you... I, what do you make of this, Bishop? Have you played it since Bungie left Activision, or...? Um... Because there's no. only this... <laughs> this Not website really. and... 
it's funny that you say this mm -hmm. because just before the show, I saw Destiny 2 and was like, hmm, I might re download that and give that a go again. Mm -hmm. It's free to play now. So isn't it? that's kind of. That'll be downloading tonight. Wasn't well, it free on PS Plus or was I wrong? It's, 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 it's free, free to buy. It's free. It's free everywhere. It's a free oh, is it? Game. Right. I think it is. <laughs> I, think I, free to play. I think it was it free to play. It originally wasn't uh, a free to play. Mm -hmm. It originally wasn't free to play, but it is now. Um, I wonder if Edgy's all over this. I mean, I don't but really of course, obviously, obviously, if you want to... So how they get you is essentially you buy the DLCs, and the mm -hmm. DLCs are quite expensive. Yeah, it's my uh, They're just, they're, they're yeah. kind of massive, big, huge expansion packs. So obviously they are kind of, you know, that makes sense, you know, that makes sense. Yeah. Um, but the original game is free, and it's fantastic. The story's great, the the gameplay's great. Mm -hmm. um, I've feels always great to wanted, I've always wanted to like a Destiny game, always. And and that's mainly because it was Bungie, right? Because it was, it's made by Bungie. Halo lineage, the, mate. The, 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 yeah, the creators mm -hmm. of Halo. And I just wanted it to be fantastic. But the problem with Destiny games is they, they they focus so much on making these these games look beautiful and stunning that they kind of forgot about the most important thing, which is content. And mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just that the games are very short. Yeah. With the DLCs, with the DLCs, it's okay. They're okay with the DLCs. If, if I, I personally think that if you bought the original Destiny with all the DLC, you got yourself a full game. And these days, these days you can pretty much get Destiny for yeah, I'm not for very very cheap all the all the, all the DLC. Don't um, play the first one to be fair. The first one's very good with it. The DLCs are very mm. good. For, like for I the, have the, the second one all over the place, but I've never really touched it. I never really mm. fancied it. Um, I I hear the DLCs are better than the actual game, which is personally kind of weird. Personally, is that I is that, a, that one. is that a fair assumption to make? Because yeah, yeah. I, I agree on that completely. Yeah. Um, yeah. The, the the thing so the thing that that's obviously that's quite interesting here, obviously, is that Destiny Two is still going. Mm, yeah, that's that's true. After yeah. all this well, time, yeah, right? I don't thought that. Yeah, because people are, it's still must have an audience yeah. because. Otherwise, yeah, just otherwise they just wouldn't pack up and they just wouldn't be doing this annou them. announcement on the on the ninth of June, would they? They just wouldn't be doing exactly. That. Um, so I'm excited to see what what kind of shows up, what comes up. Uh, am I going to am I going to give hope to myself that it's going to be good? No, I'm not because I've been put down and let down by Destiny f since the original. So um, I'm not excited, but I am curious. Mm -hmm. That's my answer to that. So, uh, you say, uh, are you going to download it again and go back in, or I've, it... I've already clicked download on it. Oh so yeah, I'm going to download and play oh, it again. Cool. Yeah. All right. Um, because got there's like two new expansion packs that I haven't. Played yeah, yet, there was so I might, that... I might possibly delve into them. The moon one was was the moon one last time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that was the one. That was supposed to be out, wasn't it? Or yeah, it looks yeah, good. looks good. And the the most recent one looks really good too. So, mm -hmm. um. Yeah, it looks. I, I I love Destiny, and I just I just I really wanted it to be good. You know, I mean, Destiny Two definitely did improve uh, a lot of things, but there's a f just a few things still that just kind of makes makes the these games a little bit sort of. Yeah. Just yeah, I don't know. I can I can um, appreciate that. Um, mm -hmm. There's a lot of issues about um, money grubbing and when it first came out, wasn't there? So. Yes. Yeah. It's, but I mean, probably fix that now. Um, Jam. Any interest in Destiny at all? Not really. I uh, I don't I don't risk risk uh, don't disregard the game as like oh it's just not it's just rubbish it's just oh I think I missed that train if you know what I mean. John, mm -hmm. I know what you're saying. I know I'm... Edgy used to play it like religiously and like I think is it I don't know the teams or hunt they were hunting together or something like that. Clan... Whatever it's called raiding. Raiding. Yeah, the raids. Raiding. Yeah, big raids. Uh, Mike. That, that 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 would that would appeal to me, but I just think yeah I think I've missed that. Cool. Um, anything else to add to Death of the Two before I move on to Jam's most hyped game of all time? A oh, big time. <laughs> uh, no, I just no. I think that's everything. Moving on. I think that's everything. Just a quick one for this next one, really. Um, Red Alert, uh, the Command and Conquer collection HD thing's got a trailer, and Ooh. it's fucking cool. It's not. It's not really a gameplay trailer. It's just. It's just Kane chatting shit to it's the camera. Kane. Oh, and what it, I'm and buying tomorrow. Proper like breaks the four four. Is that all? These Bell and said on Twitter that. Mm -hmm. Um, and yeah. I, I totally forgot it was coming out tomorrow. Guess who's buying it? I'm probably not going to, but um, I'll stream I'm it. I don't care. Yeah. If it was if it was Tiberium Wars, I'd be 
all up in this bitch. All it's up not. in this the wrong bitch. One, but... yeah. Red Alert 2. But it's Red Alert 2 is oh, Red, Red, Alert 2. Red Alert 2 would be 9 Red Alert 2 Red is, is Red Alert 2. Is it? Is it? Yeah, that's in there. Kind of I think it's a massive collection. Listen, I only care about Red, Red Alert 2. What should you do? Big Kane's a legend now, isn't he? It's cool. It's just... it's, it, I think I think the thing that I love about this the most is just how how amazingly well done they've done it. Like mm -hmm. how, how well the you know, the cutscenes are so unbelievably. They've kept it as is. They've not exactly changed as, it as is as as, as they is, used to have man. it. They've re-recorded all it. Re-recorded all the audio. Redone yeah. the music uh -huh. tracks. They brought him uh, back. They had the same. Well. Yeah, yeah. Brought him back. They brought had the same um, the same VO voiceover lady come in and do the oh she about building. To see. That's cool. Construction That's complete. Cool. Yeah, that, that's epic. Yeah, it's really same, good to same. see that kind of um, just just that attitude towards remaking something. Mm -hmm. That was really cool. Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. It's like with a. Uh, yeah, it definitely had that authentic feel that game, where they kept it, which is I'm really happy about. Mm -hmm. I won't mind generals again. Generals, generals was cool. cool. Um, Tiberian Sun was cool as well. That was the first one, wasn't it? So else was cool. Yeah. I think uh, I think it was the first or third. No, I think the first one was just Command and Conquer. Yeah, it was yeah. Drills was cool. Age of Empires, but we'll move on. Keeping it with VA. Cool. Better than Age of Empires. I mean, if you're going to talk about Age of Empires, you've got to talk about Star Wars Galactic Battlegrounds, right? No. Am Moving I the on. only person? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, keeping it with VA, gentlemen. Um, EA Play's coming to Steam, and I've watched, some, yeah, I've watched a few more games on there for us. So. I could not be more interested yeah, no, in but... a story in my entire life. <laughs> I mean, you, you, on the edge Could of your not seat. be more interested or less. Uh, less interested, sorry. <laughs> no, the joke. Well, the joke was there. Um, you missed it. The, it was. I know. But yeah. Um, um, the thing that's the thing that's annoying me here is the fact that they're putting all of those games that are going to be on EA Access on sale on Steam right now. Mm -hmm. It's like it's like, oh, come buy these games so that we can have some more money off you before we you actually get EA well, we Access. The it's like. Mm -hmm. I, I, yeah, I, I, I never thought that to be fair, but yeah. That's just really cheap and mm -hmm. really weird. Um, um, it's nice to see that Origin has less of an influence on my machine, though, because I hate that thing. Oh, thank God. Yeah, Origin is the worst thing. It's I swear like, to God, every time I boot it up, it's like, oh, we need to update Origin. So I, I booted it up yesterday and did the same thing. <laughs> you broke Origin, I mate. really hope, I really hope that these games um, that are on Steam, listed on Steam right now, do not open Origins through Steam. They're going oh, to. Oh yeah, I've got a few games that do that. Yeah, Fallen going... Order does that for me. They're going to. I'll tell you now. They are. They're going to, aren't they? Mm -hmm. They're going to. Like Ubisoft I, that all the time. That really annoys me. You play. I don't go really, away. Really? Yeah, you play's the worst for it. Right. You play's like, oh, and... buy this. Like, no. Shut up. Why do they do this? I mean, I know why they do it. Obviously, it's to kind of keep their brand kind of front and center so that they, mm -hmm. you know, people know stick it all on steam stuff, and but, be done with it but it's just that really annoys the gamer and oh god drives me nuts <laughs> <laughs> anyway moving on yes. so, yeah so yeah check out ea for i i like some of the ea games and now i don't want yeah, to buy them off origin i can just get them on steam which is cool yep. uh moving on last week a journalist for famitsu teased a big 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 riling up the industry announcement that's coming from a company which then later uh, appeared to be sega uh <laughs> have you seen this gentlemen yeah I'll, I'll kind of skim past this one this is something to do with the cloud gaming isn't it yeah cloud gaming it, it's called one fog, millisecond or fog under. gaming but like reduced under one millisecond sega's fog, fog gaming, gaming solution yeah. Now this, uh, I mean, this is going to be massive in Japan. Uh, you imagine if it kicks off because, oh yeah, it basically turns arcade into like uh, hot spot cloud um, data centers, da data so center. that um, people can, you know, have a more comfortable experience while streaming games. I yeah. don't right, and there's a lot of misconceptions here. Because if you think of each, like, because Sega and I don't, don't know if you know this, but Sega, I, I didn't know until earlier, until I was track checking it. Sega on a lot of um, arcades in Japan, which was weird. Um, and it's like, oh, cool. I mean, this could kick off, but you imagine us like trying to do it in here, England now. 
No, mm. nearest arcade was like Blackpool, which is for those not from England is fifty odd miles away, right? Something like that. There's actual proper wall of arcades. About is that right? No. I miss arcades. I man. do. I if I, I was loaded so much. The third thing. Oh, I I'd, do. I'd love to open my own. Yeah, I'd have it like proper retro as well. Oh yeah. I'd have like an eighty section. Mm -hmm. cool. I'm just buzzing and the tournaments and stuff. Boomer arcade. Remember the tournaments in arcades when everyone was crowded around a machine or like if someone was going to oh, get yeah. a high score. Who's getting like, oh, oh, yeah. What a cool! It's 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 just like lamp eyes. It's just such a cool experience. Mm -hmm. Like Definitely. to have. Now we send pictures to each other. Like look at my high score. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> mm -hmm. and such a, a cool no, experience. The fact checker. Here. I just, I'll, I'll just run for that quick. Uh, misconfirmation. Uh, Fog gaming is a cloud serving service that streams arcade games to players' homes. That is wrong. There's no mention of that. It's just the technology that's on the table at the minute. Yeah. Um, it will make uh, arcade cabinets difficult to exist. Well, if you're just going to put it in the background, I'm, I'm, not, I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm, I'm, I'm not an arcade engineer. Do you know what I mean? But I imagine... No, I'd be so upset to see arcades this I mean, I mean, I know they're quite a rarity now, mm -hmm. but in right. London, in London, there's a place, it's not, it doesn't exist anymore. There's a place called the Trocadero. Trocadero. And it was right. one uh, on Piccadilly Circus. And yeah, just five floors of arcades. Five floors of arcades. Five had floors, retro, that's so cool. They had bowling and stuff like that as well, and bars. But it was like it was just so good. Mario like Kart that. Two was there, by the way. You yeah. ever heard of Mario exactly. Kart Two? Oh yeah, N uh, Namco made it. I played that. No, yeah, yeah. Um, um, but I miss that place so much. Which leads the question I have for you, gentlemen. Um, is this? Uh, oh, sorry, this comes from Johan CK from Frontline. That they give us that story, and we appreciate him because. I don't have no idea, to be honest, because it's all in Japanese. Gentlemen, is this announcement one that is to rile up the game industry like the PS5 reveal? I, 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 it might do something in Japan. Mm -hmm. This is what I'm I mean, I think it has been 30 years. But this is the thing so Asia and Japan have a much more. They're, they're, they're bitching over their there. gaming culture. Yeah, their internet is mm -hmm. much better than ours, and their gaming culture is very much arcade as well. Mm -hmm. So there's and, and many Tom's. more arcades in, yeah, Tokyo. Like if you put it in like I don't know square mile radius, there'd be a hell of a lot more than if you went to Manchester or London. Mm -hmm. It doesn't really exist. Like you could probably yeah, walk like, down the street seaside there and towns, see yeah. that have them. That's about yeah. it. Yeah, um, it'd be got Blackpool, South Shields. So uh, got one. That infrastructure Wherever. would work really well there as mm -hmm. much but here I, because it's not i mean they'd people have to rather sit indoors and do it problem I don't is, know why. yeah in england they'd have to open more arcades to yeah get the they'd data have to spend money in, to make yeah, money in which that. Okay. Yeah. could work but um i but, i mean but where are, they've already got the arcades exactly. x clubs doing and they already own the old so. arcades mm -hmm. With but I wouldn't be against Sega coming to this country oh, yeah, and opening no, no. as many arcades as you want. Sega, great. Right. Um, <laughs> I'm spending money there. Oh, I'm all over it. All over it, mate. Um, Bishop, is this something that interests you? or? Uh, yeah, no, this is cool. This, mm -hmm. I, this is really cool. Um, I, I agree with Jam on this one, definitely. This oh, is yeah. something that I don't reckon is going to be big over here, but oh, over really there not. would definitely be would definitely be something that would be... Mm. Mm -hmm. Um... But yeah, I don't really have much about to say about it really, but other than the fact that yeah. Yeah, cool. That's, um would be something you'd be interested in if it did come over here and it was wasn't terrible. Or would you just stick oh, yeah. to Yeah, of course I would, yeah. yeah. I, I, I there was like a uh there was actually a gaming do you know where Dante's is in, in, in yes. where we are? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. That used to that actually used yeah, to be a you know, a I gaming it was like was it an arcade area or was something it kind of like... no they used to play fighting games and stuff there yeah. i was invited to go for a street uh, fighter tournament but i didn't make it yeah because you would have won really and it would have been unfair I, I never got to go in unfortunately which is a shame I, would have, because... I would have come near the top yeah yeah um but i would have loved to gone into that and before before unfortunately it, before it closed i would never really got time to actually get you know get into it which is mm -hmm. a shame. see um think saying is that sorry bish if i'm sorry if they, I don't know, Sega was hit the ground running with that in Japan, they went, okay, we're going to expand. Uh, Sega's back. We're going to stick arcades in like all loads of countries. And it gave us the opportunity to stream arcade games at home. I'd rather just go to the arcade. Yeah. To be, uh, but, um, no, but I'd rather go there rather you, than stream I it think, to my house. Um, the, I think it's just 
the, the power to stream it's not the actual games in the cabinet i think it's just the data center is in the yeah arcade. i know what you mean yeah. so would would you rather hmm, yeah because if it's an arcade down the street man, I'm, I'm off mate i'm yeah do you know what i mean yeah. a few yeah. beers arcade absolutely batman yeah. let's go um mm -hmm. yeah we'd be there we'd be there every day, All day. yeah i'll spend a lot of time there if there's a local one mm -hmm. anything else to add or are we in the same boat that maybe in a few years i can't see it happening over here anytime soon but in no. Japan, I imagine it's going to be... If it's going to kick uh, off I anyway, can't. it's going to kick off in Japan. Our internet won't catch up no in the next five way. years. No, mate. I mean, I no. think our internet is all right for what we do, but um, you start... You look at Japan's internet, it's ridiculous. Did you see... Oh, no, this isn't Japan. Um, Hungrybox, uh, Super Smash Bros. Pro Player. Do you see what his internet speeds are? No. I don't. It's like don't 625 know. megabyte upload. Excuse me? Upload? Mm-hmm. And then like 800 meg download. This actually makes me want to cry. Is he in, yeah. is in Los Angeles, isn't he? LA, is he? I think he lives in Florida, I think. Florida, right, okay. I think no so. I think so. Just think about all the fucking minutes that I could have I could have saved in my life doing something else whilst... <laughs> <laughs> Never yeah, mind. Let's, just, yeah. let's move on to the next story before yeah. we get even further yeah. into this. So, <laughs> in conclusion... We're all for this, but it, well, I don't, it won't kick off in England or Europe for that matter, to be fair. No, not, not. Just keeping it with Sega, though, this wasn't the only thing that was. Um, uh, I mean. This is what a lot of I people don't know what thought to think was about the this. Big, big um, up, I don't know it? if you two gentlemen saw this. Um, I did. Did, you have, did any of you two gentlemen have a Game Gear? Dan did. Dan had a Game What a legend. Yeah. Dan. No, no, Dan. Dan saw it. He spoke to me earlier. About All right, it. okay. Um, I don't. What, what, what do we think about this? Because it, it's the Game Gear Micro, right? There's yeah. four, um, four different units. Both all have four different colors, four different units, four different games on each of them, right? Fifty, fifty dollars each. So you might imagine about. Hang on, wait, what? So I didn't read that much into it. You say four games on each of them. Mm -hmm. It's four different games on each of the different colored units. So if you wanted all the games, you'd have to buy each one, and that would what? set you back. To, uh, you see, that's nonsensical. It is nonsense. And we were saying last week, or we were saying on Tuesday, sorry, that um, the, the, every N64 game can fit there. Yeah, into a cartridge. Yeah, into a cartridge. Yeah, yeah exactly. I yeah. mean, this is just Fantasy Star, it. by the way. I'm all over it. Look, outrun big game. How? Right, I'll start. Bishop, I'll go with you first, mate. Okay. Where do you stand on this? Because as a concept, oh, let me just loop it. Two seconds. I think. It, as a concept, okay. Right, um, yeah. I, I'm like, ah, oh, whatever. I, I love shit like this. I, I've got the mini and S, mini snares, yeah, mini Mega it, Drive. Yeah, it definitely gives. It definitely gives a retro feel. Mm -hmm. And you know, if you want that kind of old retro experience, then that's fantastic. Mm. However, we're not in that age anymore we're in an age now where we have the technology in order to essentially as you said have every single you know game on one cartridge mm -hmm. so is this just i mean my personal opinion this is just i mean and, I, and this is coming from me by the way mm -hmm. this is a waste of money i mean uh, john where do you stand mate I think they make cool collector's items. That's, uh, they would right. make cool collector's items. I agree on that one. Me and you. About people like me and you, Jam, see stuff like this and think they look nice and we're so fined up. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But, yeah. Um, I'm sure you're the same. Yeah. Right? Um, yeah. I don't know. Have you, ever, you ever played Game Gear? I. You know, OG I one. When I could afford about 60 AA batteries, I had a time of my life. Mate. Yeah, when you had about four. I never had a Game Gear, but my friends did. Oh, yeah, mine was. You, you, you sit by the wall and plug it in with the cable that's like that long. Mm -hmm. Get the big uh, magnifying glass, mate. You're like, oh, yeah, I'm if you want a big screen. But the games, like, they, the controls were awful. They were so bad. Yeah. Like, you could have, like, your. Um, trying to think of a game with some both. Okay, uh, Lion King. Mm -hmm. Mega Drive, Game Gear, That's Super cool. Nintendo. Yeah. Um, on Mega Drive, the Super Nintendo is one of like, the most loved and cherished games of people's childhoods. But you put it on a Game Gear, mm -hmm. it's atrocious. It is awful. It is so bad to control. Jeez, oh, okay. Uh, my thought is like, if they're going to make these more 
people are hacking, no doubt. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, mm. a day when they're out, someone would have hacked it and put all the game game gear games on it. Hundred yeah, yeah, percent, yeah. easy. Take it to the bank. Um, that will happen. Yeah, but then, have they are they gonna address that? Then they they're not going to. That'd be too much. Mm -hmm. I think Nintendo didn't address there, it. Sony. To, to be fair, sorry, Biff. Two there seconds. Is, there is, Oh, go, go, yeah, go on, sorry. sorry. I didn't even I'm so sorry, dude. You keep on cutting. You keep on cutting out a little bit. So. Do I? Yeah. Ha! Oh, you don't. You don't do one. I don't think you do one stream, but to Discord you do. On Discord you do. Yeah, I speak like Discord. Discord. A bit, yeah. <laughs> Discord. It's a pandemic we'll have, we'll to finish have, because we'll have then. Back soon, don't yeah. Worry. Um. So what, Bishop? You go. Mine's not that important. So the the the, the, the only thing I was going to say, I was just going to make a point, was was the, there is actually something to be said about simplicity. Uh huh. Having just one game on one game console is kind of interesting. You you can oh, sorry. Play, okay, yeah, you know it's on your shelf, and then go on. Sorry. Four different get four games on one, and then four games on the different four games on another. Oh, okay. And so four, it's, okay. Four, four and each. Yeah, four and each. Game. Sorry, it's sixteen the games. Why... Four each. Sorry. One. Oh, okay. Right. Right. Yeah. Um, the reason why that's cool though is I think about the amount of times that you've picked up a controller. That's turned on your Xbox, say for instance, or your PS4, mm -hmm. looked at your massive games list and gone, what the hell do I want to play? To be fair, that's a good point. Do you see what I mean? My Steam has and... got, sorry dude, uh, four, about 400 games on it, and I'm like... Pfft. Yeah, so I've, I've got about 400 games on my Steam as well. You're playing the same and games got, over again. Mm -hmm. And I've got like five games download, downloaded and actually installed, mm -hmm. which just goes well, to show you, like, you, you stick to certain games. I suppose you'll appreciate the games more the less you have. Exactly. Yeah. And and that and that goes for anything in life. It, it, unfortunately, we as human beings are paralysed by choice. We can be easily be paralysed by it. choice, and because of that, you know that is one thing. So there is that to be said. But at the same time, as a consumer, as somebody who's generally going to buy an item, you would expect more as opposed to less. If you see what I mean? Yeah, especially with the $50 each. Um, just another quick one. I'll just I interject this into the story. There is a magnifying thing, accessory, which yeah, looks cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not much else said about yeah, that. Yeah, cool. Nice. That's a I mean, nice at addition. this point, they should have just, they, they could have made a Game Boy-sized Game Gear, re-released it, and put a load more games on it. 110 quid. I think it would have sold better. Yeah. But again, if I mean let's look at them videos, it's marketed marketed for Japan so oh, far. Yeah, I right? think right. it's only available okay. in Japan as we speak. I think uh, so that, that's yeah. the impression I got anyway because there's not an English um, advert for it yet. Yeah. From um, what I know, like, if I'm wrong, I'll, I'll take it in out. your pocket and yeah. taking it out of your pocket and playing it on the tube or something it's the like. Size of a easy, isn't it? If you yeah. public transport. It's better than holding your phone, and to be fair, mobile games are trash most of the time. Most of the time. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, I still won't want to play Sonic. No. Um, Lee, I have a question, though, gentlemen. Um, yeah. The games are, on the black one, you get Sonic the Hedgehog, Puyo Puyo 2, Outrun, and Royal Stone. Great game. On the blue That's one, one I get. Yeah, on the blue one, you get Sonic Chaos, Guns to Heroes, Sylvan Tail, and Baku Baku Animal. On the yellow one, you get Shining Force, Gaiden, and... Some enzymes, I don't know, sorry. <laughs> Shining Force, the Sword of Hyjia, yeah. Shining Force, Guide and Final Conflict, and Nasupoyo Aruru no Ru. And on the red one, you get Revelations, the Demon Slayer, Megami Tensai Guide, and Last Bible Special, the GG Shinobi, and Columns. Which one, if I put £50 in your hand and said you buy one of those game gears with that money, which one would you buy? Black. Well, that one. Bish? I'd probably go black too. Yeah. Um, I'm probably inclined to Out, agree with outrun you. Poyo Poyo. I'm, I'm a man who loves guns to heroes, though, you see. I might have to get that one, but it'd be guns the back of the blue one. And I do like Shining Force as well. See, it's going gonna, it's gonna to have, have a bit of a problem here. But, I love uh, Gunstar Heroes on Game Boy Advance. Yeah. Guns to, Bish, you ever play Guns to Heroes? I actually haven't, no. It's and on the PS3. It's incredible, mate. Anyway, Dan, Dan, what are you on about Dan the monstrosity? 32X was a monster. glorious piece of kit. Dude. <laughs> Dude. Not on this show, mate. Not on this show, mate. No, no, no. Anyway. You'll be banned from the chat yes. in a second. Ja banned. <laughs> Jack will get, get the, the ban ammo out. Buzzing. Right. <laughs> Anything else to add to the Game Gear Micro, which is available um, 
sorry, Sam Byford from The Verge wrote us that beautiful article which we um, dissected. Anything else to add, gentlemen? No, no just, I, I mean, if they that... come out here at maybe 40 quid, I might get one just... Oh, mate, I'm just probably... I don't... I'm talking... I don't think... It... Go on, Bush, sorry. I don't think it'll do well over here. I don't think it'll, I don't think it'll do well over here, but I think it'll do well in Japan. Oh, yeah, Japan. Yeah, that. I think it'd be one of them stocking fillers at Christmas, uh, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Um, anyway, I would, I'll probably get one. I might have, I might have bought one. I don't know. It's a cheeky film. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Jim. Oh, actually, one more thing. Sorry. Oh, go ahead, mate. Go ahead. I'm actually disappointed it wasn't Sega being, uh, Xbox being rebranded oh, in Japan. Yeah. I would, in my, the, the rumour was, those in the chat, those in the YouTube comments who don't know, the rumour was that it, the Sega were going to like join with Microsoft and they were going to publish, in a way, the Xbox Series X in Japan, so it would be the Sega Series X. And I'm telling you oh, now, be cool. I would import one of those. Yeah, I would. Yeah, I don't want, have an yeah. Xbox, I have no need to own one, but I would import one. Just a Sega logo and an Xbox. I'm, like, I'm in, mate. Let's go. Yeah. That would be cool. That's yeah. a major collector's item just, just there. Mm -hmm. so that mm -hmm. rumour seemed to come out of nowhere. And it was really weird. Yeah. But um we're all in. a weird rumour. That all is in. a weird rumour. Um anything else to add before we move on to the un uh, the forgotten gem? That was that was it. Is that it? All good. Yeah. Jam. Apologies uh, on Tuesday. I so we're totally. I think we're all around and we forgot to do the forgotten gym. Yeah, no, that's do what I, I remembered it, but I thought no. We'll um, anyway. By all means, if if I forget something, just just slap me in the face and just say. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. It's because we had oh, more time. We, we forgot just as much as you yeah, did. So. <laughs> an hour and a half, I think, the last episode was, which was. Yeah. Um. Anyway, jam. By all means. So this week's forgotten this, gem. This week. Um, talking about your last one, buddies. Mm -hmm. What was it? Something buddies. Team buddies, team buddies. It like you said, you were sitting down with your mates, uh, multi tap. And you're playing just in the four of you in a room, mm -hmm. uh, and I used to do that with a game on the PlayStation One. Oh, you know? Now this isn't necessarily a forgotten gem because it has been revisited count countless times. It's just never been bested. It's never been a better game. I'm interested of this series. Am I going to disagree before you it? show me? Am I going to disagree? Or is this an outright fact? No, oh, it's not right fact. Bishop. I don't know. I, I don't know. What you You're ready to jump on him, mate. Sure. Right, I'm going to give you a clue. <laughs> Let's see if you can guess what it is. Go on. Go on. Then. I'll I'll guess one game. Kicking. Yeah, go on. It's a racing game. Micro Machines. Be free. I'd... Boom. Are you serious? Oh, Micro Machines was so <laughs> yeah. good. Oh, what a great game. I completely forgot about so, this. Like I say, it's been done so many times uh, over and over. Um, I can't say for my machines V4. Uh, never played it. I wasn't as good as this one, dude. I no, I, I know, I know. And then I got the PS4 one, the World Series. I think it just didn't come anywhere close. But I, I oh, don't I think that it existed. It's not. I don't think it is anything to do with the game. I'm sure like people that are 12 years old now will enjoy that game. But it, like I say, like you. With your mates around one screen, oh, four mate. controllers, or oh, that point of Micro Machines V3, you could actually, um, oh, you could if you Lord. if you only had two controllers, you can have two people on one controller yeah, I remember using that. one I side of it each. That, f that warmed uh, me up. I absolutely love this game. Mm -hmm. um, absolutely all fantastic. the weapons and in the, the the characters, I think I can't remember a game beforehand other than Outrun. Uh, when the Outrun was a bit older than this, but. They had voices and things like that, and they had personalities. Spider was my dude. I you, think that was his name. When you picked them. Pardon? Spider was my dude. I think that was his name. The guy in the Spider, leather jacket yeah, and the Spider. sunglasses, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm just watching the gameplay now, and I'm just I'm just buzzing over it. It's just, it's Did you ever so play this, cool. bitch, mate? So uh, yeah, 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 of course. So I, I actually love this game. It's I, I apologise. <laughs> um, so yeah. good, mate. Do you, have, do you play the second one? On the Mega Drive? Me Me Micro Machines yeah. 2? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, right, that when one I, when was I, good. Loved it. Yeah, that blew my mind. So there he is. Might be, I don't know, but yeah, blew my mind because when it um, when it came out, it come on the cartridge and there was two controller ports on the cartridge, and I was like, that's insane. What's going on? Here? Yeah. And then Sony brought out the multi tap, and I'm just like, what? And then Nintendo were like, oh, it's four ports on the console now, and I'm like, all right, <laughs> you got four people? Yeah. What? I don't know four people. They're the multi PS2 multi tap like as well. Micro Machines oh, yeah. always reminds me of Mashed. Always. Yeah, I was just about to say Mashed, PS2, well, technically Mashed. Technically, Mashed is inspired by, yeah. Did you play Mashed, by Micro Machines. 
No. Mash was great. You pretty, oh, oh, I had, that was another one. So good. Yeah, I know. Mash, Mash was, Mash that was, was my Bishop there, machines. mate. Absolutely loved it. Yeah, 100%, mate. So good. Mine. I need to ask you, though, Jack. Yes. Do you agree with me that it's not been bested? I really like two, though. I'm not sure which two one I good. prefer, but I, 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 I'm not going to argue no. the fact that V3 is really, really good. I'm not even going to argue the fact that you said it's the best one. I'm just, I'm just going to put on the table that your boy here likes two. Yeah, that's, fair that's fair enough. And I've, I've, it, it might I have mean, been... it just holds a lot of memory to yeah. me as well, so that's why it's up there. And, uh, I, 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 I think I think each of us are probably going to have you know similar kind of agreements and disagreements yeah. on, on that just due to the fact that we've had different experiences. As That's children. it. Yeah, it's it's the beauty of it, Bishop. Next it's week, beauty. Scott and Jem with Bishop is yeah. Halo Three. Scott <laughs> <laughs> and Jem, Destiny Two lads. No, no, we're good. Um, time for the quiz. Uh, there's a bit of a spanner today. But be a bit cheeky, gentlemen. You know what I'm saying? What there's a mm -hmm. there's an artist I like. Um, he makes new wave, um, synth wave, whatever. I don't know what the I, I don't know. Music, um, video inspired by video games, and you can tell what it is. Do you know what I mean? Okay. Um, yeah, okay. So yeah. well, I'm gonna play a snippet of a song by Kumu. His name is. Go and check him out. YouTube, Spotify is all over the place. Um, very talented guy. I want the franchise the song is from because it can be a bit hard to. To distinguish with it being a cover of a song it could be a bit hard to distinguish which, which yeah so i'll accept the franchise of the song of the game of the what the song's from uh three songs if it's a tie i'll just put another one on um are you guys ready yeah down yeah, in the chat, I'm doing it ready? The chat first uh, let's get rid of that uh let's get rid of this as well hang on we're not allowed to answer for an x amount of time yeah. are we um i'll give you yeah. Give it like we'll let the chat go first. Yeah, so um, Dan uh, and anyone else in the chat, I'll give you 20 odd seconds, 20, 25 seconds. And then if you haven't answered by 25 seconds odd, um, what we're going to do, bash anything in the chat and the first in the in the Discord or in, in the Twitch chat, and the first one to, to who comes through first then can answer the question. Do you know what I mean? Like so just, yeah, so buzz in, basically, and then answer. Don't write it in the chat. Okay. So we'll let chat go first, because they'll be... Yeah, ch chat go first, obviously. Right, you ready? Actually, yeah, yeah. I need the series that this game is from. Jam, you have to get this, mate. Let me know if it's too loud. Or too quiet. This is tune. Wow, this is sick. That one for me. Right. One gentleman. Can I answer yet? No one's done it in the oh, chat. Wait. Go on. If you know. <laughs> Shout up if you know, gentlemen. Star Fox. Hey, Star Fox. One of the jam. Would never have gotten it. Well, Bishop. Funny you should say that. Because <laughs> if you don't get this one, you're fired, mate. Okay. <laughs> yeah? Are you ready, Bishop, mate? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do this. I know it immediately just from the downbeat. Game and watch. I have no idea. But it's awesome. This is a sick remix, yeah, by the way. Kumu is the guy that knows, and Bish, you're welcome to um, buzz in and guess. It is Terraria. One all. Put it for you, mate. Now. I did. Thank you. Gentlemen. Much appreciated. Just giving me points. Uh, huh, huh, huh. What did you, oh, I thought I had one picked. I don't. Sorry. Give me two seconds. Give me two seconds. Oh, that's what I'm gonna do. I need the series that this game is from, gentlemen. Okay. Um. Oh, just waiting for an ad. Have you two been? Been on? 
Yeah. <laughs> right. yeah. Cool. Just fill in the space. Yeah, fill in that the time. Sp- right. <laughs> Gentlemen. The franchise, if you will. I know it. I'll take a guess, but... Um, two seconds. Jam yeah. knows it. No one's said that in the chat. Jam knows it. Um, Bishop. I'll let Bishop have a guess. I'll... Is it Crash Bandicoot? No. <laughs> no. Okay. Good guess. Unfortunately, not the one. Jam... Well, I've, you... just second, I've just second-guessed myself, but oh. I think I know what it is. <laughs> Jam, what do you think it is? Castlevania. <laughs> Was I right? Yes. Castlevania. Awesome. Balls in. Oh, well done, Jam. Um, right. Anything to add before we end the show, gentlemen? I'm still oh, quiz, really? king. quiz king. Quiz king. <laughs> yeah, you are. Um, you probably will be quiz king for the rest of your life, Jam. <laughs> no, he's, doing the, he's doing the song. When right. we have thousands of viewers, I won't be. Yeah, he's doing the song next week. Um, if you want to... Yeah, I don't I'll, know if I'm going to do it. I'm, I'll just do it next week. send me the files. Oh, no, how... Send me blank files and I'll one, two, and three, and I'll just whack them on the screen. Is that oh, going to work? We'll yeah, figure it out anyway. A, um, it's been a good show, boys. Yes. Big, thank you for joining show. me, gentlemen. Um, are you, uh, Bish, are you going to be streaming soon, or are you going to be on on the web? I'm still, I'm still so unbelievably into music theory right now that music I just have theory. no time to do so. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, he doesn't care sorry. about his stream mm-hmm. community I do anymore. I do care about my stream. <laughs> oh, he thank loves it, mate. He loves it. Um, I would. I'll try and get back onto it. Soon, yeah, uh, the um, the orchestra song thing. You did it. It's really cool. Especially yeah, actually, it's really good. Especially for, really for, good. for the first go. I've learned. I've yeah, first go. Yeah. I've learned a lot since. Yeah, then, so. honestly, dude, keep it up. Um, if you haven't heard the song, you can check it out in our Discord, the Casuals Club Discord, which I shall put in the description if you're watching on YouTube. Uh, Jam. You stream oh soon? my god, Dan's got mashed. I see actually what Dan's a legend, mate. Yeah. Dan's one Mash is so good. Dan's and Metal Gear Solid too. He obviously knows what good Metal Gear Solid games are. He obviously knows that um oh, shush. Jam. Are you streaming this weekend? Is it Rocket League Friday and Smash Saturday for you? Is Rocket it... League tomorrow night and Smash um it's today's Thursday, right? Yeah. Mate, it's Rocket I... League tomorrow night, Smash on Saturday, but Command and Conquer's out tomorrow, so we gonna do Mate. There'll be some come on the right, yeah. stream. I'm in. Um, I will be back next week on Tuesday for a casual report with these two fine gentlemen. Um, please, if you're watching on YouTube, don't forget like, subscribe, ring the bell. Um, helps with the algorithm. Tell your friends. Come tell us our opinions or shit, and then we'll have a nice chat. And I, I can't wait. That's the idea. Um, yes, that is great. Anyway, guys in the chat, Dan, legend, mate. Thank you so much. Everybody, keep it casual. Peace. Jam's a gimp. <laughs>